But first, she has won Olympic gold and the Dancing with the Stars mirror ball trophy all before the age of 17. And for most people, that would be enough, but not for Lori Hernandez. Courtney, you had a chance to sit down and talk with her, and she's something else, huh? Yeah, yeah she's, she's a little intimidating because she's pretty accomplished, and she's added even more to her resume now, so her next accomplishment is author. Oh, my goodness. So let's take a look. Hi, I'm Courtney Yates, and we're getting ready to speak with Olympic gold medalist, youngest winner ever of the Dancing with the Stars Mirrorball Trophy, and new author, Lori Hernandez. How many hours a day did you put in? It was probably about, give or take, it wasn't always, but it was like six hours a day, six days a week. I've heard you referred to as the human emoji. Where do you think that came from? Well, I think as a gymnast, we're known to be very focused and stoic. And, That's true. Uh, we don't show too emotion, but I can't help it. I mean, anything <laughs> that I'm thinking really shows up on my face. And so. Well, I think it really paid off for your Dancing with the Stars performance. <laughs> what was your favorite part of doing that show? Well, my favorite part, uh, first off, would be that I got to learn how to actually properly like walk and dance in heels. Oh. As a gymnast, you're barefoot all the time. What from gymnastics were you able to apply to your dancing? I think we could definitely use the endurance and the stamina from gymnastics. What can you give us about your next Olympic run? Cross your fingers. I'll, I'll be coming back <laughs> probably by the end of the summer. Start, you know, easing my way back into it. You can't really just throw yourself back into the sport because it's not safe. But tell us what inspired you to write a book? So, I mean, I think I just wanted to show people, you know, I had this incredible experience in the past year. I wanted to show that it didn't just happen overnight. It took a lot of years of hard work and sweat and so many other things. It took a village to get me where I am. It was so nice to talk to you. Thank you Thank for taking you. time for the little things. Thank and you, so you should come visit us sometime. You are one Gosh. lucky chica. Yeah. You really are. I know. She was great. Was she great. was great. And I know you were a gymnast, right? I was. At not the level that she was, but I can yeah. tell you, if I were, you know, little, little, I would be all over <laughs> her. Because she's also, I mean, I'm total transparency. I love that she's Puerto Rican. Hi. Resident oh, Puerto Rican in the house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's okay. nice to see... Um, in the sport, gymnastics is a very expensive sport. So I remember oh, I was yeah. the only Latino you know, for miles. Yeah. Um, so this young woman, she's done more yeah, so in 17 driven. years. Did anyone else watch her on Dancing with the Stars? I, I certainly did. Yeah, she's she was amazing. amazing. Yeah, she's incredible. I can't even do a cartwheel. Barely a somersault, <laughs> but it's very impressive. You know what? I, I do feel like though nowadays the younger generation is a lot more motivated. They, they, they're not as intimidated by the older generation, like they just think that they they can achieve anything, and I think that's great. Yeah, that yeah. is something definitely that I also agree with. And the great thing about her is, I feel like she is not only a role model for young people, but she's a role model for me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I was yeah, in there totally. taking notes. So I'm like, tell me how to be like, how do you be you? Like, really? I want to, exactly. I want to know. Yeah. <laughs> the Times named her as one of uh, the top 30 most influential teens, and. The book is now a New York Times bestseller. Yeah. So it's like, well, we all, who's reading it? We all have a yeah. lot is to it learn from her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is it teens? Is it adults? I think it's everybody. I think it's probably mm -hmm. everybody, yeah. I think everybody's yeah. interested in anybody that has a mind of champion. You know, that's mm -hmm. that's so, such right. discipline, and it really is, it, you know, you use it in any part of your life. Yeah. yeah Especially for kids. Very mm -hmm. articulate and poised, which mm -hmm. for, you know, a gymnast is not necessarily, like, a necessary quality, so I think that just like adds to her. Yeah, yeah she's her got too many gifts. She's beautiful. Can she just she, tell us it's down a too much? <laughs> but do you Stop know what? She's uh. super, super humble. Yeah. She um, credits a lot of her success to her faith in God. She's like super, super passionate about yeah. her faith. She sticks the landing every, yeah. every time. Yep. Get my ten paddle out. <laughs> she always sticks it. 